Hey guys, this is Tactical for the Win, or you can call me Raphael. This is the latest installment of my new series called The Story of My Life, Episode 2. And this series is not about the gameplay, and it's more concentrated on the story I have for you guys. And today's story is actually a really embarrassing story. It was my first fight, and it was around 7th or 8th grade. I can't remember exactly, but I can remember that I was in uh, middle school. And I was really cocky back then, and I used to hang out or spend a lot of time with people who were older than me. I thought that would make me cooler or something, or more popular for some reason. And I didn't used to hang out with people my own age or younger, always older people, and uh, sometimes with my classmates. Uh, so let me give you a little backstory. There was this guy, the guy I fought... Uh, Almost nobody liked him, even including myself, uh, for some strange, stupid reason, probably. I was in middle school, so I probably didn't think that well as I do now. And that guy was really cocky, and uh, he had bracers. So everybody would make fun of his mouth that uh, they would say that it looked like a horse, <laughs> like a horse's mouth. And it was really funny. We used to make fun of him, and he had this really uh, hot girlfriend, which... Uh, I ended up dating her after I fought him. So if you guys want to hear that story, uh, leave a comment below and I'll tell you about it. Uh, anyways, so yeah, he had a really hot girlfriend and uh, everybody said that he was really cocky and uh, mouth like a horse and all that nonsense. So one day I was hanging out or spending time or talking with... Uh, the older kids, like probably from ninth grade, probably from high school, because my school was high school and uh, and, and middle school, uh, at the same, you know, unite, uh, combined, like two schools in one, and actually the school was from first from, from like kindergarten to like uh, twelfth grade. Uh, anyways, so yeah, we were at lunchtime and I was talking about that kid and how how I could beat him and how I could punch him and he would cry and all of that and then someone said you know like why don't you put your money with your mouth it's like why don't you fight him and I'm like yeah the cocky asshole that I was I was like yeah I could probably beat him so yeah I'm gonna fight him so I started talking trash to the kid I was telling him that I was gonna uh, kick his ass and all that I was actually really skinny and really really small like I was like four nine or four eight or four even like four six I was really really small uh some people even called me like Yoda because I was small and my ears were pointy that was really stupid I hated when people called me that but yeah I was really skinny I was uh my personality was always like a gamer and such so I was always you know playing around the house not playing any sports or anything so I wasn't that physically fit and it turns out that the guy was a boxer. Like, he was into boxing and he trained every day. You know, he knew, he knew how to punch and stuff. And he used to say it to me, but I didn't, you know, like, pay attention. I was like, fuck you, man. I could still beat you up. At least that's what I thought. And, yeah, one day, uh, people started telling me uh, when was the fight. People was encouraging me that I was going to beat him up and all that stuff. And I, everyone started talking to me. And I... And I felt like some kind of popularity and I liked it so I went on with it and then a couple of weeks passed and people were saying like oh you're gonna bitch out right you're not ever gonna fight him or anything and then I'm like no I'm actually gonna fight him today and people were like really I wanna fucking see this like I wanna see the fight and then I go up to the kid and he's with his girlfriend she's really hot and then I talk to him trash and say he's a pussy and all that. And he's like, no, I don't want to hurt you. So I'm just going to stay calm. And then I hit him in the face. Like I slap him. And then he gets furious and starts taking his watch uh, out and his chain and all that. Uh, I think he had a ring or something. And he was taking it off. And while he was doing that, I <laughs> took a cheap shot. And I sh hit him in the face as hard as I can. I even broke one of his bracer brackets. Uh, he was complaining about that, and it was so hard, like, I punched him with all my strength, but then, out of nowhere, he fucking hit me, like, not once, not twice, like, he hits me, like, five or six times in a row with an amazing fucking speed, I'm probably exaggerating at the moment, but it felt like that, it felt like the most powerful punches I've ever been hit in my head, 
like in my face. They were all landed in my face. And then my face was really red and really swollen. I even ended falling in the ground like an asshole. And, you know, I got beat up, you know. I was teach the lesson that day. I learned the lesson, not be a cocky asshole. Anyways, that was the story, and the uh, gameplay just finished right there. As you can see, I couldn't call in my airstrike, but I mean my helicopter, but I hope you enjoyed. This has been Tactical. Peace.